Uh, Hetty. Uh, you know what? Let's not add to the pile. Oh, no. Oh, Peter. Peter! Hey, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Open XCOM. So things have uh, escalated rather quickly, I would say. Uh, we found some Muton Commandos last mission, and which I would think, ah, eh, it's just another small UFO, but I'm kind of interested in checking it out. I'm tempted to actually just leave it. Um, because the, re the reason is, I don't know if it's worth it. If it's even worth going there. I shot it down, which means there's no Illyrium. Uh, I almost said Zerbite. Uh, no Illyrium, and I may get a few alien alloys out of it. I have tons of money, so doing this small UFO will get me only a possible casualty. So I don't see a reason for it. So I'm going to let it pass. Um, part of me wants to just see what's there because there may be some other race there, but I'm going to resist the temptation to do it. And we're going to uh, hopefully see if we can grab one as it lands. And as a matter of fact, you miss are missing two people. Someone who got injured? Oh, Nook got injured, that's right. So we'll throw Ivan in there and uh, Soup Carrier. Actually, you know what? Kazak, Space Voyager, take seat. Let Tango and Horse get in there. And you guys will need some armor. Uh, there we go. Okay. So let's go ahead and send that... Which way are you going? You're going up. Okay. North. So send... I'm going to go ahead and send you that way too. We're going to lose him. Actually, he's going this way. Uh, North Star. Why don't you come over here to Alaska and see if we can grab him? He's awesome, but he might uh, intercept you. You go to the last place. You can go home. There he is. Perfect. Okay, you sit on him. Uh, you know what, buddy? You can go home. Because I have an intercept right here that is itching to not shoot down, but just follow somebody. What is it? One of those. Just let it go. And hopefully it sits. I right, don't. No. Stop that. We get exciting music for this. There we go. Perfect. Oh, uh, was it nighttime? I think it was. Do I want to sit and put this off just a little bit longer? Yes. It can't be. It won't be. It'll be landed long enough for that, right? Wait, are you going home? Go back. Um, okay, go home, but then I'm going to turn you around. Why can't I just tell you just to sit for a minute? Okay. You should be fine. I will longer there. Okay. Sky Ranger, get in there. There we go. We have a landed one. There we go. Illyrium. Perfect. I did have some wounded folks. I had so many wounded people in the North Star base that I had to bring a no-name, so Huahui <laughs> has decided to join us. With a name like Huahui, you will do fine, sir. I keep hitting the wrong button. This is what happens when I, when I play Robo Tycoon and then this, I hit wrong buttons. <laughs> so I'm going to give you this, though, because just in case it's something, you could get some, a little bit more explosive damage. And Jay Stink, former commander, will have that. There's nobody here because we are at the edge of the map. There's an edge right there, too. So just plop it down there. Uh, we're going to save the second smoke. I may use it next turn. Let's try a different strategy here. All right, so Jay Stank. You see nothing. You see a floater. Okay. All right. Hoa. Is this like a Hawaiian name? I'm sure I'm butchering it. Over there. Is it the edge? This is a tiny one. Uh, okay, do that. Uh, Jay Stank, you know what I could do? I could back you up and then shoot with you. You need 25. No, you know what? I'm going to let someone else do it. Hellraiser can probably do it with one shot with a sniper rifle. If I can hit. I need 20 to do a snapshot, which won't hit. Yeah, there's nowhere near. We got some wheat. We got some, some wheat. 
Uh, something with a real gun. Hingle, there we go. There's a real gun. Do I need it? Um, that should be fine. And can you do an aim shot? Oh, he missed him. I was supposed to miss Peter. Give me some snapshots. Nice shot. Okay. Now I had to bring. I forgot I had to bring Peter too. Yeah, I have. I have all these names in the in the uh, the headquarters base, and I have not enough here. Well, I have enough here. They are just all wounded. Got Yoda in there too. Brutal barbarian. We're just gonna kind of clamor out of the craft here. Uh, Jay Stank, you know what? Just go ahead and plop that down right there. That way we can move up a little bit more. Why does everyone have these in their hands? There you go. Come on out. And Watercrest. You have a good gun. A good, uh... Oh. Where did that, did that come from in here? Hmm. I looked away for a second. I didn't see where it came from. I think it came from here. The only thing I can think of is it came from in here. In here or over here. So we will prepare for dealing with that. Um, just go back here. Poojin. I got Poojin in here too. I have so many non-named folk. Uh, Hetty. Uh, you know what? Let's not add to the pile. Oh, no. Oh, Peter. Peter! There he is. There's the jerk. Um, Jay Stank. Tell him what you think of us. Oh, not of us. Of, <laughs> tell, tell him... Let me try this again. Tell him what we think of him. Thank you. <laughs> oh, man. That's bloody. This has already become far bloodier than it should have been. Floaters. But you know what? We get Illyrium out of it, so we are okay with that. There's been a shortage of Illyrium because I haven't been... I haven't been letting things land. I've been just kind of shooting them as they go. Because I never trust that they will land where I want them to. By, by where I want them to, I mean on land. Without them getting away from me. But we're going to kind of just inch up everybody. Uh, you know what? Hang out behind this wall here. And go ahead, Diggity. And Zavis is going to stand right there next to you. Brutal Barbarian. We'll put this in his bucket. And then move on up. Actually, you know what? You're a little bit overburdened, so put that on the ground. I think I initially, when I had the squad lined up, these two guys were in the front, which is why they had grenades in their hands. Then I moved it around. I really want to know what those are. I almost know what they are. I cannot wait until we know what a heavy plasma is. That'll be the day. This whole campaign, 49th episode. This is the 50th episode. And we are sitting here still using human tech. It has been an experience. That's for sure. You know, whenever I... When I was debating on... Before I began this, this LP, on what kind of LP should I do? Should I do like a special rules kind of thing or should I do a mod? One of the ones I was tossing around was doing a special rules thing where I am only allowed to use human tech for, throughout the whole game. It's one of the ideas that I had and uh, I decided to go with this mod instead because this mod looked pretty cool. So I guess I actually got kind of both of them in one, one shot. Oops. <laughs> Who wants to scout? Let's just send up a scout. Um, this is such a small map. We can see everything here. It's a nice flat map. Hua hui. Get on up there. Tell me what you see. So we can really see. Pretty, we can get everything this way. We'll just play it safe since we've already lost two people on this mission. Um, did I blow up my? Alloy shotgun? I think I did. I had another one over here. Because he has a pistol. 
It was it was it watercress? I think watercress blew up. Sorry, watercress. Oh, we got two of them. Oh man, they're just itching to get shot. By Zavis. Give me an aim shot. Take that one out. What do you mean there's no line of fire? Is that wall that? There you go. He didn't kill him. The other one's right here by the door, which can we do it safely? Like with, this might kill him. I think the floaters have gotten a little bit tougher. I didn't used to survive those. I have too many rockets here. <laughs> All right, we want to do it the peaceful way, but nope. We are going to blast them. Oh, this stupid wall is causing all kinds of problems. Oh, really? You missed. I was so close to shooting at the ship instead of him. Oh, well. Hattie's got you covered. And... Brutal Barbarian. Why don't you go ahead and... Uh, reload. J-Stank. Commander? Oh, man. Man. Not Commander anymore. You're out of bullets. Will somebody shoot this thing? Stop shooting the wheat. Yoda. Thank you. It shouldn't have been that hard. Is the front door on this side over here? Yes, it is. All right, Hua. Let's rush back over here. Come around this way, and GFYE will get it right in there. I'm guessing he's standing right by the front door. That is my assumption. You know what we could do? We could just toss a grenade there, probably. Who has an arm? Anybody here? Ingle does not. You guys are a little ways back. What we could do, though, Jay Stank, you can move up to something like this. And while Yoda... Tosses you a grenade. Yoda can't throw that far, right? Oh, it's right on the edge. I can't get a grenade in there anyways. All right, well, give it to Jay Stank. And he will move it up. So something like that. It's right on the edge of the map. I can't get a grenade over there. All right, come take a peek. Oh, he's not there. Hmm. There's two of them in there. And there's an Illyrium that we don't want to blow up. No energy. No energy. <laughs> Alright, Jay Stank. Let's figure out how we can do this. Oh, I just know I'm going to get shot here. I can feel it. I know we're going to get shot. Uh... How's your reactions? Uh, all right. All right. Oh. Oh. So you come over here. And don't get shot, please. Can I get in there? I could run in there. I have some energy. I could run in there, take a shot, and then get back. Destroy the Illyrium. Oh, I can't do that. I cannot take that shot with his gun. I can't do it! Alright. We're going to do this the old-fashioned way. I, I'd only be able to stun one of them, though. Alright. By old-fashioned way, I mean with grenades. Do you have a stun rod? No. And you have explosive ammo, so you're not going to go in there. Do you have a plasma rifle, sir? You do. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right, so Hoa could do some things. Why aren't they coming out? All right, we're going to go in and get him. Snapshot. Kill him, please. Oh, you missed. Hoa, you're fired. GFYE. We could go in there. We could rush in and stun. We might be able to do this. We might be able to do this. I don't... 19... I don't think we will be able to do it. We're going to try it. We're going to go for it. You know what we could do? We could stand at the edge here. 
since they're not coming out. We could come here and just hope they don't come out again and then get both of them in one turn, or we just run in, stun, and run back out. That might be a better idea. Actually, you can go right there. I know you see him. Stun this guy. Oh, that did not work at all. Of course you don't have energy. Of course. Of course you don't have energy. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Stupid mistake number one. There you go. Oh, sorry, GFYE. That was way more painful than 50 Illyrium should have been. Yeah. Yeah, we lost that shotgun. We blew it up. That is a shame. All right, let's continue. That was a little bit of a disgraceful mission. Oh, we got cannons there. Where's the interceptor? You know what I could have done? I could have just taken one of my existing interceptors and done it, but that's not. That's okay. Uh, equip craft this new guy. Okay, so this is going to be... This is the cannon round only guy whose job is to shoot down those enemy Sky Rangers. So we're going to call him uh, Cannon Craft. Okay. And then we're going to sit for a little while. Oh, yes! Finally! Finally! I cannot believe it. We still don't have it. We have to go. We have to do the clips. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? There we go. This is such an exciting day. I never thought this day would come. I thought for sure I was going to lose this game before I got <laughs> heavy plasma. Okay. <clears throat> Pacific Interceptor. Go grab him. Number 95. Please grab him. Please grab him. We're not going to get him. Oh, we turned back around. So we are going to get him. Wait a minute. What am I doing? What am I doing? Take him while he's still up. Take the Illyrium. Yeah, just follow this guy. We want the Illyrium. This does make a case for doing this Illyrium. Maybe I, it does make a case for maybe putting a Sky Ranger in the Pacific base. I don't know. I think I'm okay. Do me this way. We get to listen to the exciting music for a little while longer. Oh, it's gonna be a nighttime mission, isn't it? Is he gonna land, or is he just looking for my base? He might be just he's doing the zigzag thing. Hmm. He's out of here. Where's Hoff? We'll send him there. Stay in range. Oh, man. Ah, now we're going to lose him. Go there. Uh, oh, that was my... Oops. Are we going to find him? He is gone. Lab of Osiris is complete. Do we have enough living quarters for it? We do. Okay, so we can fit 50 more guys in here, right? Our clip is almost done. So let's grab 50 more scientists. I could probably buy a few more people. I have a lot. I have had a few deaths. Here we go. 96. Uh, headquarters. Interceptor. You're running a little low on fuel. We may not be able to follow this guy too long. Large scout. It'd be nice to grab him if he's on the ground. Especially if it's daytime. Uh, let's see the way. All 
Alright, just shoot him. Just don't shoot him in the Illyrium spot. Okay. Uh, you know what? We should probably put a cut in the video. I'm at 20 minutes. Yeah, let's do that. So, before we grab this guy. So next time we'll grab this small one. And we'll who knows what will be in it. So thanks for watching. I will see you next time.